I couldn't believe my eyes when I heard my dad's voice on the phone. It had been ages since we last spoke. Hello dad? It's me, I stammered, my voice higher than usual. I've missed you. How are you doing? I twirled a strand of my long, red hair nervously. Dad's voice sounded strangely cheerful. I'm calling to thank you. Thank you thank you thank you so much. He chuckled, and I could hear the joy in his voice. I didn't believe you when you first suggested it, but I'm glad you persuaded me. Well, drugged me. I blushed, remembering the day he had convinced me to embark on this wild transformation. I must admit that I was very surprised when I woke up and found that you'd changed me so much, I confessed. The breasts were the first thing I saw, and that was a shock. Then I saw the long red hair you'd arranged to have implanted into my bald head. My fingers traced the outline of my face, which had undergone extensive plastic surgery. The dental work, the plastic surgery on my face, the laser work to rid me of my body hair, I continued. Oh, when I woke up, I know I was calling you all the names under the sun, and I'm sorry. Dad's laughter was infectious, and I found myself giggling. Then when you insisted I put the peach bunny girl outfit on, I wasn't happy, I confessed. I wasn't a happy bunny. Dad's voice grew warm. But now I see why you had me do it, he said. I've been here for a month already, and I'm having so much fun. They've already told me I'm going to be Miss April with my own centerfold. I nodded, though I knew he couldn't see me. Two questions though, I said. One, can you arrange for me to see the plastic surgeon again, please? They've asked me to get DD breasts. Plus, I want to get rid of. Well, you know what. It just gets in the way now. There was a pause on the other end, then Dad cleared his throat. And two, he began, hesitating slightly. They've asked if you can help out this weekend. It'll be the first time they'll have a father, son at the mansion as bunny girls. I couldn't help but smile at the absurdity of it all. Sure, Dad, I replied, my voice filled with newfound enthusiasm. I'll be there, ready to hop into action as your bunny girl sidekick.